Some things look good small, but some things look even better when they're bigger. That's the idea behind the new full screen view in iPhoto. Jump right to full screen with a click. You can browse, skim, and organize your events with bigger thumbnails and more room to see more of your pictures. Click Faces and you'll see all the people you've named in your photos spread out on the corkboard. Or see sprawling edge-to-edge -edge maps in places showing where your photos were taken. The new Albums view gives you easy access to all the albums you've made. You can skim an album for a preview of what's inside or double-click it to open the album. Your photos look incredible when they take over your whole display. Click here and you have instant access to all your editing tools. You can make a quick fix, like enhancing your image, or you can instantly add effects to make your photo even more unique. And it's all so much easier when you're working with your photos in full screen. The full screen view in iPhoto. For the first time ever, the photos you share in email can actually look really great. And with Photo Mail and iPhoto, it couldn't be easier. Now, you can create emails that look more like a page from a custom photo album, without having to go back and forth from your email program. To get started, just select a photo, or even a whole group of them, up to 10 at a time, and then select Email. You can choose from eight gorgeous Apple designed themes like cardstock, postcard, and announcement. Then, give your email a personal touch by adding titles and other text. You can change the arrangement of the photos. Just drag them around any way you like. If you want to focus on the best part of a shot, click to zoom in and move it around. You can even include the photos as attachments, and it automatically scales and optimizes each one. PhotoMail works with all popular email services. Just select the one you want and send your pictures straight from iPhoto. iPhoto keeps track of every picture you've shared. It even saves copies of each email you send and who you've shared them with. And if you want to resend them later on, it's just a click away. PhotoMail in iPhoto. It's as close as you can get to sending someone a framed picture, only a lot more convenient. Slideshows in iPhoto are a fun way to share your pictures with your friends and family, especially with the incredible new themes. And they couldn't be easier to make. First, just select some photos from an album or event. You can even include video clips. To create a slideshow, choose from 12 beautiful Apple designed themes, including new ones like origami that uses face detection to focus on the people in your pictures. The new Holiday Mobile theme is a perfect way to enjoy all your favorite pictures and videos from the season. Every theme comes with its own music, or you can use any of the songs in your iTunes library. And with the Places theme, if your pictures have GPS data, or you've added locations in iPhoto, they're automatically combined with maps and titles for a gorgeous animated travelogue. And your slideshows look great, no matter where you watch them, on your Mac, HDTV, iPad, or iPhone. There's something special about a coffee table book, especially when you're the one who created it. You've probably got a lot of great photos stored on your Mac that you'd love to show off. Now with iPhoto 11, it's easier than ever to turn them into amazing books. Just select some photos or an event, and the kind of project you want to make. The all-new Theme Chooser is where you explore all the beautiful things you can create with photos on your Mac, with your own pictures already in place. And the best part is, once you know how to make one, you know how to make them all. Just click on the theme you want, easily change the book size, or the color. The All Pages view lets you see your entire book right away. iPhoto gets you started quickly by instantly filling your book with your images. Photos taken on the same day appear together, and your highest rated shots are featured more prominently, 
Face detection automatically centers and frames photos with people in them, so the focus is always where it should be. Of course, you can easily arrange pictures anywhere you want. Grab any shot and swap it with another. You can also zoom in and drag to see the best part of the photo. Just click to edit a page. Change the design by swapping the photo layout. Or change the text just how you want it. Even add stunning two-page spreads for a dramatic view of your best photos. Or drag pages in the same way to instantly reorganize your book. When you're done, you order your book right from iPhoto. And when you click the Projects view, you can see all the books and cards you've created organized on a beautiful bookshelf. Hardcover books arrive in a protective sleeve. They're professionally printed and bound by Apple and shipped straight to your door. They include a dust jacket that matches the photograph on your book cover. Gorgeous photo books made in iPhoto. They're the perfect way to share your favorite pictures with your family and friends. The newest thing in iPhoto uses a centuries-old printing method, letterpress printing. For the first time ever, you can combine traditional printing techniques with your digital photos to create cards that are one of a kind. To make a card, start by choosing a picture right in iPhoto. Then select one of the elegantly crafted designs for a variety of occasions. You can personalize each card with your own words and order with a click, whether it's a single card or a whole box. The letterpress design you choose is then physically pressed into ultra-premium paper, creating a beauty that can be seen and felt. Then, using the latest digital printing technology, your photos and text are printed on the card, so they blend in seamlessly with the letterpress design. Cards include matching envelopes with unique letterpressed elements. And when someone receives a letterpress card you've created just for them, it feels special, and so do they.